Welcome to the art studio. Today we'll be talking. Mm. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Welcome to the art studio. Today we will be having very deep, meaningful conversations, won't we? <laughs> God knows what the fuck we'll be talking about. I don't have to swear in every... That's just the way I speak. Yeah, you should work on that. Nah, I like the way I speak. I might change it for now. Nah, you will. No, I won't. You will. Nah. I don't think I curse that much. Every second. If you were on a, you do an too, interview though. and did to bleep you out. <laughs> you bleep. No one would be able to bleep guess bleep. what language you're speaking. It'd be a constant bleep. So we're in the art studio, midget art studio, trying to think of doing a podcast. We're uh, planning on doing one. Planning on doing one. And man, we're not good at planning. <laughs> We've been here for an hour. We still haven't came up with anything. Have we? The spine of which would be like <coughs> talking about art, not art history. Well, yeah, it's art yeah, history yeah. as well. There's some cool shit on art history. Yeah, well, you know what you can do for next week? Check out Jackson Pollock. He's got some mad stuff, and it's not just the paintings. There's on YouTube you'll find some um, some guy did a like a video interview with him when he was on his property back in the day. And it was very interesting to hear him talk about how he, how he's going about his process. Like, mm. And it's, it was like a big two fingers to the establishment. Uh, he's pretty cool. I like him. There was another guy, a Jewish lad. He did all, you've probably seen him, but you, you probably don't realize that it's this guy. But it'd be like a big canvas of red, we'd say. Just red, a flat red. And then there might be a slightly off red box in the middle or to the side or down the middle of the canvas it's like they're it's like they're moving like 3d kind of yeah it's trippy it's very cool i forget his name again my names are just shocking <laughs> but um yeah there's some cool stuff in the in the history books but then I, you know do you know there was something out the government was doing last week about don't even talk to me about the government the artists because Jim Mellis is on to me about it. Like, That's his art friend, by the way. Oh, yeah, Jim is my buddy. He's a painter, too. He's class. He was telling me about this grant you can apply for. It's like a basic income grant for artists. It's, oh. it's, it's a trial thing, and I'm like... How much? <laughs> how you... What's, what, what's, Give it to me. What's the story? And he's like, oh, I'm definitely going to fill out the paperwork. I'm doing this. And I'm like... In my head, I'm thinking, what a waste of time. No money, man. No, 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 no. See, that's more canvases, more paint. That's more. Ah, oh, fuck off! Look, you can't. <laughs> you're gonna be in the studio just staring at a canvas for your life. You're fucked. You've lost. You have to get. You have to mix shit up. I mean, I won't play for a grant because number one, I hate. I hate paperwork. <laughs> I Who hate fucking it. likes it? And number two, I like the fact that I can go somewhere else and do the stonework, for example. Mm. And you know, you meet people and the landscape. You're in it all the time, and everywhere I go, there's horses. It's awesome. So it's like you know, you're constantly thinking of a painting you're working on while you're somewhere else doing a physical job, a good job that you like. And you know, it's it's just way better. And you you know, that's how I pay for the paints and the canvases and the studio and stuff. I think, you know, everyone should aspire to do something like that, you know, because instead of being in the studio all the time, I trust me, I did that for years, five, six years, and I thought I'd fucking go crazy. <laughs> or maybe I did. I don't know, but it's, it's way more you fun, <laughs> even though it's kind of stressful in the sense that you feel like, fuck, I was too tired to get into the studio, but I'd still go into the studio, but I wouldn't do anything because I know, oh, well, you get to that precious stage, and like, I'm too tired, I forgot this. I know I'll fuck it up. But I'll sit there and I'll think about it, and then it'll be like, just the tail, just work on the tail, just a little bit. <laughs> yeah, a little bit, uh, yeah, of time. And before you know it, then herself is like ringing your phone. Where the fuck are you? <laughs> it's 12 o'clock! You know. Impetus to talk. Mm -hmm. Confident? Well, no, I wouldn't say confidence. Confidence, confidence is a scam. I mean, there's no such <laughs> thing as confidence. Fuck. That's bullshit. There it's, is such thing as called like, Jack fucking Daniels, man. No, you're just being your age now. You look for every excuse to do nothing but the painting. You do everything but the painting. <laughs> Whereas when you come back from work, then you're like, you, you horse the dinner into you. Just to get into the <laughs> studio and 
let rip, you know. Enjoy it. Have Enjoy you got the guitar here, have you? Yeah. Uh, I have a few of them there. I have to tune it and everything. I've tuned the bedroom and I have one here. I have two here. I think I have a Spanish one on a, my horn or 12 string, but I have six strings on it. Because I'm a loud cunt when I start singing and I can't hear the bloody guitars. <laughs> honestly, so I took six <laughs> strings off the 12 string. Well, to be oh, fair, the that neck... must have been difficult to play. Twelve? Yeah. Yeah, no, it's great. <laughs> no, that I'd say the fucking. I mean, I'm only playing like three finger chords all the time anyway, and then sometimes I get really lost in it, and I end up just doing one finger touches. Keep that light, right? I don't even know where I'm going with it, and it's just, just keep fucking. It's like you know when you're a kid, mm -hmm. and you're running down this steep grassy hill. And in your heart to hearts, you know you're going to fall at any minute now and you start laughing. <laughs> and you, yeah. you're just like, what am I laughing for? I'm going to, I can get hurt. And you just, you can't stop laughing. <laughs> and you're bombing down this hill and boom, off you go. <laughs> and you're still there and you're laughing. It's like that. You just got to keep going and sit. Actually, it's the same when you're baiting the crap out of the canvas. So like, it's just, it's like you're in the zone. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's awesome feeling. I love it. And time is just, it stops. It's a beautiful thing. They I'm also, not really a team guy, you know. I prefer oh, solitary, just yeah. like run away there for us, you know, have a good time. And then, what else was I doing? I was doing the karate and the boxing, but Stop. that was more about just for the exercise yeah. aspects. I wasn't like interested in competing but, and doing shit like that. Would you be the kind of person who would be calm and, you know, you could be on your own without feeling lonely? Oh, yeah. Really? Yeah. I can't. I, I'm You're like, tapped. I just. What? <laughs> What'd you fucking say? <laughs> I'm not fucking tough. You are fucking stupid. I'm I'm stupid. That's that's rich coming from you now, Jamie. Yeah, well there you go. <laughs> you heard it there. There it is. No, it's it's uh I don't know, it's just like if you, like, with a team, you you, you watch soccer, right? You I have never. you have a player who you know is excellent and you know that they're hard working. But he's gotta fucking hope and pray that the other knuckleheads in the team are just even going to put in an effort today. Because they might be like, ah, sure. I tried, buddy. You didn't fucking try. You, you ever watch Ray Keane? <laughs> the players, like, <coughs> the man, you can see the veins in his forehead popping. And he's like, you didn't even try. Just oh. a lot of that. So it's like, why would you allow other people in that regard, you know, fuck up the progress or the potential progress mm. that, you know, if you're going to put the time into this, at least it's on you, you know what I mean? So if you win, you win, and if you lose, you know you lost. Yeah. But you you gave you lost to the better person or whatever. If you could pick anyone in the whole world ever born, they could be dead or alive, to meet in person. Who would it be? No one. I know. Come on, there must be someone like a, an artist or a. No. Really, you wouldn't like to meet Picasso or Van no. Gogh. No. Really. Really. I'd love to meet a uh, Freddie Mercury. Good for you. Fuck that. <laughs> James is your homely bit of stuff. <laughs> no, what's the why? Why would you indulge in such silliness? You are here it's, now. You know what I mean. You got to be. You got to be fucking in your own present, and you got to be doing your shit. You know, if you're gonna be wishing your fucking life away and your time away, it's just a disgrace. Man, this is a this this is a chat. Right, just play with it. Just play, play. No, 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 no. You don't have to be so fucking judgmental. It's not. It's not about being judgmental. It's just, you ask me a question and I answer this, and you're getting all weird now because <laughs> you know in your heart to heart you're a lazy fucker, <laughs> no, and you think he's attacking me now because he knows I'm a lazy fucker, and I just want to go and hang out with Freddie and talk shit. For the day. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Hearts. Fuck. <laughs> <coughs> Don't cough in my pants, man. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh. Oh, yeah, afraid to be delayed to fucking see you coming oh. coughing all over. <coughs> I bet you wear a mask. So, next question. Oh. Fuck. <laughs> I've got a target. What? It's like September now, right? Yeah. By the end of October. These three paintings would be done, and the one behind there, and is there another one? But we're nearly... Oh, fuck. The end of October, the four of them will be done. Fact. Or else they'll be bust. <laughs> but they'll be done. They're, I mean, there's, 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 they're not a million miles away. That one now, I think, would be fucking lovely when it's done. 
Yeah, I'm never doing that again. <laughs> Ever. <laughs> Jesus Stress Christ. Girl, it's man, like, yeah. what was I thinking? <laughs> I had a notion and then I messed it up and then it's like, well, you're nearly the only one. <laughs> Jim is always saying the thing. It's, you got to plan your pants. <laughs> so I try to be more kind of, uh, I don't know, like, you know, expand into other areas yeah. and try to, you know, but no. Try new things. Yeah, fuck that. Just <laughs> go what you know. But do you think Marge. that's the hardest paint you've ever done? No, it's what's... just the most boring one. <laughs> <laughs> but that's worse. Yeah, if exactly. If you're, if you're stuck, you know, you There's can no see upside. you have something to do. Like, I tell you, you know, when I'm halfway through getting those horses done, it'll come back to me as it being exciting again. But it's just you hit a rut. I'm like, oh, Jesus, you're still not finished. <laughs> I've been at this for weeks and it's not finished. And I'm looking, you know what the problem is? I had like four, see, that's a nice, that's a nice size canvas. I had four of them, like the background, blankety me. blank. And I was just looking over my shoulder. I can't wait to get that them. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and I'm trying to do this one. I'm like, why is it so green? <laughs> and I'm like, oh, fuck. And I'm looking at them. I need an explosion of boom. Oh, they're, 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 back to they're trees, are they? Yeah. If you want them to be. <laughs> no, it's fucking turf. Of course it's trees. Well, to a castle. No, yeah. It looks, I like the I'll tell you where that was now. That's, oh, that's real. Sure. Yeah, I was, when the Kilworth and Aragorn Harriers would go on like a fun run thing. It's like, it looks start like of their season. Kind of. Yeah. They, when they have new horses or whatever, oh, they bring yeah, them, yeah. they might be, what to say, green. So they'll bring them along to kind of get them into the habit and into the meeting the other horses and all of that jazz. And so I'd usually find out, oh, it's on that day. I'll go there that morning and I'll bring in the camera and I'll be there with the phone and the camera trying to get some film. Fuck, I just realised something I could have done now and it's remind me that I didn't do it. Because we have two cameras, yeah? We could have had one on you and one on me. I'd have no, a go one to one. No, no, that's not stupid, sure. If you look at like video podcasts and stuff like that, and all of them are alike in the sense that most of the time it's, oh, Joe Rogan's talking, <coughs> video him, or your man's talking. And then sometimes they'll have a panel where you can see the whole room where the whole group are talking if there's more than two. Well, I don't three. really, I, I put on a video podcast, but I seldom watch a video. You know what I mean? It's on, it goes, oh, that's great. And if I go and I'm doing I, I would, I would, I'd watch a video podcast. I think there, some of them are interesting. If, I, some if, of them are boring. if I'm on the couch sick, and it's a shitty day and I can't move. I'm like, I'll watch a podcast or I'll read a book. Or, you know, that's what happens. Yeah. I start reading a book while there's a podcast on. I started the podcast. Yeah, this is fun. <sighs> I'll read a book. <laughs> and I'll have the podcast on in the background. <coughs> and then you might have music on in your phone. So you have three things going on. And it's like, at least I'm not focused on the whatever's wrong with you. People actually want to see paintings being painted. So I must do some of that. Um, a live stream would be great if you did a small paint and starting off a live stream off Instagram even an Instagram live they're simple yeah we'll live. see I, I'd want someone here doing that like, no no you, if you've got I'm a not fucking shit off enough because it's like I have to be focused on what I'm doing I can't be did that fall believe did it or I not right? if you went on to even downtown you might be able to pick one up uh, the phone tripods just the small ones that have extended them. I must get one of them out yeah. Amazon do very good but like you do that then right and it's it looks a lot more professional because you have it oh, on professional. What what is professional? Experience. Dictionary. Is professional. Right. I'll re I'll rephrase. I'll rephrase. It looks a lot more nicer. <laughs> but because it's not being moved and there's nobody holding the camera, it's still. There's no fucking up with it, do you know what I mean? Once you have it to that one place... Until I get the smack of a paintbrush. <laughs> <laughs> but you can't be worried about what people are interested in, I think. You can't, because you go mad. It's like if I'm going off doing my stonework now and I'm getting my money and I'm buying my stuff, I'll paint what I want to paint. Mm. And I'll put it out there in the end and maybe someone out there will see it and say, you know what, I like that, I'll buy it. But I'd be damned if someone says, this is what I want you to paint. I'm like... No, <laughs> I've tried it and it's just, oh, it just, it just doesn't work. It's, it does, no. Anyway, so yeah, I came back to and I was like trying to do. I mean, if you saw what I put on there at the start with the charcoal, it's basically a fucking scribble. 
and you flesh it out then and you build. I should have got a projector and just projected the fucking and trace. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you probably would have been better off. And then that, at least that that's... Although that did come out fucking lovely. You got the shape great, like no, it, 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 no. It, 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 it's if that egg. horse came alive right now, it would drop down on the floor and it would be screaming in agony. <laughs> that's a fact. But it's it's look it's <coughs> I, I have no problem using it. a projector, but it's just it speeds things along in regards to like. Let me see how I can say this now. You have your sketch, for example. You have, all right, there's my idea. Now, my sketch, as you saw, is a small little book I have. And the canvases are huge. Now, you can easily go there if you have the time. <clears throat> but like I said, between work, the kids, and other stuff, I, I seldom would have. And I, that's why I'm probably stuttering at the minute with work getting finished. But um, if, if I just put it on the projector and boom, da 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 dum ba boom I'm halfway there faster. It's not going to affect the end product really because all I'm doing is I'm putting a shadow where I want a shadow, and the shadow is basically a, a, just a shape, a ghost of an image. And I'm right there, you go. I I do that now and off I go. But no, Dopey here has to go the hard, long fucking road. And I'm, it's like, oh, that's why I get so angst because I'm like, you're an idiot. Can I use that lighter? Yeah, sure, lighter. I don't have a lighter. I like my. I actually don't even have one. I got a lovely lighter from Spain. You just I, dropped along on the floor and you light up a cigarette. Yeah, I need a fag. But no, the the painting thing is awesome. As I said, it's good to have a hobby. <laughs> I do, I'm, I'm gonna have a hobby. It's called punching down. <laughs> hobby. Quality is is kind of. <coughs> it's an old fashioned notion now. Oh. Mind your quality. What's the bottom? What's the margin line here? Quantity, bitch. You know, I mean, we, last time we were in Prague, now we, Prague is a beautiful city. Like, talk about architecture, but then you see some of the new stuff that they're trying to integrate into it. I was like, why did you do that? There's another, they have these big fucking, uh, it, the timber pots for trees. Mm -hmm. They're not even timber. Everything is plastic. The stone is a plastic thing. Like a plate you can lift up. Oh, and yeah. like the beginning of the end. <laughs> it's so fucking soul destroying when you see that shite. It really is. It's like, we all know it's fake. Why are you doing it? Get some fucking pebbles, man. <laughs> Throw them in there. Leave it alone. Nobody likes their job. Yeah, well, I love my job. I love my two jobs. I have two jobs I love them. Because if I didn't, I wouldn't be putting in the stupid hours and I wouldn't be putting in the stu I wouldn't be getting like 24 7 on. Looking at photos on my phone from when I left work yesterday evening. Mm. I'm making sure that's the way it should be. You know, it's like a sickness. <laughs> but if I didn't love it, I wouldn't do that. <coughs> and it's like, <coughs> uh, you know, there's other ways you can make money. You know, especially today with the internet and all of that stuff. God, that band is shocking. You're, you're very... You're very bad for that shit. Like you're always criticizing yourself. But yeah. And I feel like the I minute mean, you, you actually do an amazing painting that everyone else loves, you still say it's shit. No, when it's finished, I'm delighted. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fucking give me a cigar. I remember I had a teacher in uh, my secondary school, and he said to me, "Art is never finished. Never Why say you're fucking finished. idiots like that. Give <laughs> a fucking clue of reading a script somewhere. It's like you know what I used to hate in school. You know when they'd be giving you these um, poetry. Yeah. English poets and yeah. Irish poets. And then what they actually meant here with, and I'm like, did you meet them? Did they tell you that? <laughs> Were you there? You're, you're kind of a dictatorship now as opposed to leave it open to individual interpretation. So fuck off. Yeah, painting is a trip though. I mean, you. It's fucker like. <laughs> Shit, what I mean? It's great, yeah. It's great being into painting. It's a hobby. Oh, it's archery. not a fucking hobby, and don't ever say that to an artist. <laughs> you'll get your eyes bulged fucking out. You it's don't get hobby. it, man. You don't get it. It's fucking not a hobby. You can't. It's your every waking <laughs> and sleeping fucking. It's in your head constantly. It's it's like that's factory settings. Artist, end of. There's no like maybe hobby. Fuck off. <laughs> it's none of that. I hate those fucking. <coughs> oh, that's a lovely hobby, man. Fuck you. I'm only working here so I can buy my paint, so I can paint. 
Well, you have a lot of fucking patents then anyway, that's for sure. Actually don't, I'm... I'm you had more, didn't you? They're in a gallery up the top of the country. Um, I haven't Excuse spoken me. to them in two years. You know, I was having this exhibition. What's it called? The Puffin Gallery up in the top of the... It, it's practically England, it's that far north, okay? <laughs> and um, Right. I think the day before the thing opened, fucking everything got locked down. <laughs> I like, oh, for, of course. So I was like, they're still up there. And we haven't, there's been zero communication. Did you get a few bob for it, like? No, they, they were on exhibition, like, and they're on their website. So it's like the gallery, um, I don't even know if the gallery's still open, because a lot of places have shut down, like. They, oh yeah, well, COVID, again, you but know? you know what, though? The thing about that, because everything that closes down during COVID, like the first lockdown, they all got money for that. That's fucking neither here nor there. I mean, it's not about the money. You know what I mean? You have to, you want to go out and create something. You want to do something. You, you don't want to be sitting at home, oh, it's okay, I got money coming in. That's just not good. Your brain goes to shit. There's like a load of artists, just they get stoned, get together, and they just paint a shit ton of paintings. And they're all tripping. I don't understand. I, don't, I can never do that. Well, not that I smoke or anything, because I don't, mm. obviously. <laughs> Anymore. <laughs> But I, I couldn't, I have to be sober as a fucking sober painting. It's like... Have you ever tried painting a painting stone? Ever? Or dr drunk even, for the crack? Um, kind of tipsy once. <laughs> but to be fair, it was a dark painting. And it was very, there's a lot of symbolism in it. And it was, uh -huh. to be honest, it got to the stage where I look across the room and it would freak me out a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> I could have painted over that painting. It was this big fucking red face. And the eyes were all black. And then there was like a clock dripping out of a cheek. It wasn't dripping, it was like cracked. Sounds like my vice principal. And then where the mouth is, there was a broken chain. And then underneath that then, there was like, uh, instead of a neck, there was like uh, church windows, nice tall, with light coming through to a lake. Sounds like you were on some serious fucking drugs to be paid something like that. I was, I was just, you know. <laughs> Contemplating the universe and stuff, and that's what popped in. <coughs> I think the more, if you're doing it regularly, and the more you, you kind of put your, your mind out there, or open to out there, you just, like say for example, you and I, we're, we're playing the guitar, yeah? Mm. And we're fucking out words. You're, in, for my, I'm out here, and then like, you've been the lazy fucker you are, you nice go one. to sleep, I don't, because I'm twitchy. And I'm awake all night and I'm just, I'm not even focused. I'm not even, I'm just idly messing around with my guitar and scribbling stuff down. Next thing, bang, a whole song comes. And it's something you can work on for the week or two. And I'm very happy with it. And they're like, what, what, what made you write that? I, I don't know, I was awake, you were asleep, so you don't, you missed it. Whereas if it was the other way around, maybe it went to you instead of me, you know what I mean? Mm. I heard uh, an interview with, oh, who was it? I think it was Eddie Vedder. He was going on about saying something like, to Neil Young about a song. And it, that's that's kind of drivel Neil Young came up with. And, well, Eddie, if you were awake that night, you, maybe you wrote that song. They get very fucking weird. But it is weird. It is. You can't but get weird about it. A lot of people who write music, though, they, they could be writing one song. They take a break, write another song, and then they'd actually fuse the two songs together with certain lyrics because they find that. Didn't Kurt Cobain do that? I think so. They'd jumble up lyrics and make a song. Like you could have had half songs here and there. Say, so fuck it all together. Yeah, that, that sounds good. Sebastian, I'm thinking, he fucking scribbled on one of the pages. Why didn't he? He didn't go like la 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 la. He said, What do you think of this? And the brush hits him. I was like, <laughs> I'd rock kick him out the window. <laughs> but no, it's look, it's cool. They they love it coming in here. That's good. They got your But uh, it's just too small to be this fucking guy. It's too small You for... need a big fucking garage, that's what you need, a massive garage just to have paints. When we build a house down the road, there'll be a uh, specially built for it. A big stupid block. Of empty space for me. <laughs> yeah, I'll be happy. And the kids. No. <laughs> we'll bring this and they can have this. Oh, not a bad idea. Yeah, just put padded walls up or something. <laughs> Off you go. 
I actually, oh, I seen this thing. It's so fucking cool. It's a nightclub, right? It's a nightclub, but it's inflatable. So it's like. What about the girls with their high heels? That wouldn't work. No, the floor is not inflatable. The walls and the top is, and you got like a. Was oh, a pop up nightclub? Yeah. So you be blocked. It's a fucking. It's. <sighs> it's about. So See, that's roast. people with too much time. That's people having a lot of fun. That's right, sure, yeah. And it has loads of speakers I, I can't, in. You're just, oof, oof. What I do remember, which isn't much, back when we used to go to clubs and shit, it's not... It. You want to be really out of your fucking tree to enjoy it. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Zombieville. I enjoy it. I and everything gets clicky, clicky. And then, you know, there's a certain fraternity. After a few drinks, what are you looking at? Jesus. <laughs> I was just walking over there. But they're, they're fun when, look, it's like anything else. It's just, some nights are awesome. The, the nights that were never planned. It's like, I look, I'll meet you for one or two, but I gotta go then. Four days back. later. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so broke. <coughs> so, are you playing guitar at the moment? Uh, I haven't in a while, but I can play, like. I'm not asking you to play. I'm just no, no, but like, I have you something like constructive that you're doing with your time? Why yeah. did you get back together? <laughs> no, 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 I did that. No thanks, not never again. Do you know whose voice hasn't changed at all since the nineties? Like Celine Dion. Oh fuck, fuck. right off. What? I don't want to talk about that crap. Stop, Celine Dion. She rakes my queen. head. You are. Ah, ah, ah. No, no, no. She's a fucking pain in my goddamn brain. She I is. hear that girl. It's like, sink the boat. <laughs> sink it. No. She's fucking amazing. She's just so painful. many songs. She could take a really good song and turn it into a fucking masterpiece. Like, she, like all by myself. That fucking high note in that. But I don't get it. Right, is that what people are interested in now? Is the technicality? No, it's it's not just the There's way. No fucking, it you know no... what my problem with her is? What? She's annoying. She's terribly annoying. In what way? How is she annoying? She owns her mouth and I'm annoyed. <laughs> I'm running away. It's fuck, like, fuck. So there's Michael Jackson, Metallica, James Hetfield. The minute you walk into a Metallica gig, he owns you till he decides he doesn't. Amazing, hypnotized. Um, who else? Lincoln Park were okay, but your man was annoying. The guy kill himself. <laughs> um, who else was there? There was another band. I forget their name, but the Beatles. I like the Beatles. Yeah, I, do you know what? I was watching that documentary, The Lord of the Rings, lad made. It's brilliant. It's not like I suppose all he did was just edit it together in a fashion, but it was very, very interesting. It's it's really um, you. You really get engrossed in it mm. if you're if you like music and watching bands put shit together like, and uh, the way it all balanced out is pretty cool. I like it. I like it. Are there any podcasts that you like that you listen to a lot? Like your go to? <sighs> My go to. I was just to Tommy Turner you now. The <laughs> Tommy yeah. Turner does not have a podcast. He does. He does not with Hector Fuck and around. some other girl. Ass. I've it's watched very it. good. Well, like, is he funny in it? Like, I don't. I just have the sound on. I don't know if there's a, even a video. Babies, you wouldn't know. Um, uh, what's that one called? Joe Rogan's with them. I have it on my phone. Um, very good. That he was in Africa. He's gone on about um, I forget which part. But the, is it Troka people? I don't know. Some charity, anyway. I I like Tommy. I was just to him. It was funny, and Hector's good as well. And Yuan chimes in with some funny bits. They're good. They're a good uh, unit. They work well together. But you, they're obviously friends, and you know that kind of comes true. And it's it's nice. And you know the guy with the shopping bag on his head from Limerick. I can't think of his fucking name. Got a horse outside. You know what I oh yeah, fuck he's your got a podcast. He's I like listening to him as well. He's. He's very good. He was very about, fucking Irish, like. He was on about he was in Spain recently in Madrid and in Barcelona, and he had a he went into this shop where you can order a, a spliff, mm. and he said it's so specific. You can say, well, this is what I want to get from it, and this is what I don't want to get from it. <laughs> I don't want to be paranoid. I don't want to be lethargic. I want to be upbeat, happy, and boom, boom, boom. And it's that's exactly what I got. So he went into a gallery, and he was speaking of the Queen. He went into a gallery and oh, my names are just, I'm blue with names, but 
there's the Spanish artists who did portraits of the Spanish royal family. And I said the the amount of inbreeding <laughs> oh, well. with the Spanish royal line. Really? Their jaws became like pugs. Oh, you know, oh, they couldn't oh, even oh, eat a dinner kind of jaws. Oh, oh. But you see, he's going through, he goes through in great detail because he's very well read and he's very intelligent and he's very articulate. He does a very good job and I really enjoyed listening to it. But, uh, but he goes... He's a stand-up as well, is he? But he, he's like a comedian in the sense he'll hit you straight away with something, like a topic, and he'll meander away off, way off, and then ties it all back up to it at the end. And it's like you went the wrong route. Do you watch a lot of comedy? Stand-up? Uh, not really. Because there's this one fella, I am fucking glued to him. He's so funny. His nickname is Fluffy. Well, that's me gone straight away. I'm not going to listen to that. No, 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 no. It's a stand-up comedy. He says, I'm not fat. I'm fluffy. He's a Mexican. He's fucking... Oh, I know this guy. Gabriel Iglesias yeah. is his name. He's he funny, is so funny. fucking funny. i got to go in and i got to get water. Cause... Will you leave the door slightly ajar? Yeah. <laughs> I think I have a bottle from working there. Will you bring it out to me? Uh, a bottle of... Vodka? No, water. <laughs> Talking to yourself? No, I don't do that anymore. <laughs> anymore.